Yo guys, what's up and welcome back to another video here on Sankam's YouTube channel. Now whether you've seen from the title, the thumbnail, whatever, today we're off to Coventry. Well actually tomorrow off to Coventry. Right now it's Friday night while I'm filming this intro and I'm buzzing for the game tomorrow, you know. Because look, I've not got fond memories of travelling away to the Sky Blues. The last time I went is when we played them in the FA Cup back in 2018. When we were in the Prem, they were in League 2. It was the season we got relegated. Mark Hughes' last game, we lost 2-1 to them away from home. And it was it was a dismal. It really was. It was one of the biggest shocks of the tournament in that season. And I want to replace that memory with a good one tomorrow. But that's going to be a difficult task at the minute. They they are they're in great form, aren't they? I mean, 11 games unbeaten, sitting in 8th place, 3 points off the playoffs. Under their manager, Mark Robbins, they know if they beat us tomorrow, that's going to be a huge step in their playoff push. They've got brilliant players. I mean, the main one that everyone will know at the minute, Victor Giocarez, second top scorer in the championship with 18 goals. They've got their midfield maestro of Gustavo Hamer. Like I say, it's going to be a very difficult task. 11 games unbeaten for them. But we're not in too shabby form at the minute either. We we seem to be playing a lot of the sides that are going for the playoffs, even promotion at the minute via the automatic, some could say. We're putting dents in those pushes. You look at, you cast your mind back to quite a few weeks ago, you have the 5-1 win away at Sunderland, the Stadium of Light. Then the 3-2 win at home to Blackburn. Followed by the 1-1 draw away at the Riverside. Michael Carrick's Middlesbrough, who were pushing for automatics. That that draw put a bit of a dent in that in that hope for the Middlesbrough fans. And then last week, well, not last weekend because of the international break, but last game for us, the home 0-0 no -no draw for Norwich. So at the minute, we seem to be picking up good form to finish off the season. And we seem to be opposing a difficult, a difficult game for teams that are pushing for the playoffs. And I hope that's the same for Coventry today. I mean... Their last game, that 4-1 win away at Blackpool, fantastic performance. They dominated the side who looked destined for League One football next season. So, look, all you can hope for is a good away day. It's, it's a big away end, I think. Stoke are bringing a lot of fans. It's not too long of a journey. A win, it'd just be unreal. The limbs, the carnage, it's what you want from an away day. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let's get down to the ground. That was a long intro. Come on, Stoke. And we've arrived at the stadium. Let's get in the ground. Come on, boys. All right, then, so we're in the ground. It's expected to be a big turnout for the Stoke fans today. But it looks like there is two. It's about 10 minutes before kickoff. We really want three points today. Let's get into the game. Come on, you Potters. <laughs> Go. Go on. 
small boat into the middle. Oh, Campbell! Oh! 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 Stop! It's a corner for Stoke Brown shot. Took a deflection out for a corner. Brilliant for Stoke. Into the middle! Oh, wow! Oh, oh. We should have had three by now. Off the line from Ben Wimot's front post header. Lauren, move to Campbell. Into the middle, cut back. Small bound! Oh! Oh! We should have had about three or four by now. Small boat's chance. Great save by Simon Moore. Power shot blocked. Unreal start. Let's go! 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 Let's go!
Josh Wilson. Going solo. Gets the shot away. Blocked. Jokerez. What a save. Blocking for the third now, 20 minutes remaining. Campbell drives at the Coventry defence, cuts back across the area. Lawrence, the footwork, get a shot away. Small bone win! away days I've been on, if not ever, in a long, long time. I mean, a lot of these Stoke fans probably went to Sunderland away and that would have been top notch. Today probably equaled that. This was a full away and noisy, absolute carnage for all four of the goals. But more importantly, the players deserve more credit than anything. Neil deserves more credit than anything or anyone because we're on a run at the minute. Yes, it's only five games unbeaten, but it's some sort of... The wheels are turning now. You're really starting to see a team that could make the playoff side of this season probably a little bit getting ahead of ourselves. But next season, I really see this team going far. Pushing for automatic, probably not, but the playoff is ours next season. If we carry on playing like this, dominating pretty much every team we're playing, Sunderland, Coventry, both away games, tough away games in this league. And we've torn apart both of those teams. We're on a great run at the moment. 
buzzing with the game today. I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. I mean, there's no doubt for a Stoke fan that you haven't enjoyed it. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe. That's Sam Camp. Peace out. Come on.